Hi Pisces, Narai here, gonna do a reading for you. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Nodes. Please know to take what fits and leave the rest as this is not a personal reading. This is gonna be your bonus read because I woke up yesterday so shocked and surprised at how many Pisces actually viewed my video and liked it because majority of my subscribers are Capricorn because that's how I started my channel. So thank you so much for that, I appreciate you. And I thought that you deserved a bonus rating. So, Spirit, what message do we have for Pisces? Please and thank you. Message and guidance for Pisces. I have the King of Cups. This is a devoted person. Somebody emotionally mature and intelligent. Emotionally intelligent is what I'm saying. Um, this is a person that's very compassionate and supportive. Mm. Nine of Wands. This is a perseverance. This has to do with having boundaries. This is also a person being pushed to their limit. It could be a, a matter of you being loving and kind and a person pushing you to your limit to try to test your boundaries. And so that's why boundaries are very important. But it could be that there's something you're working on, Pisces, and you're about to give up. And Spirit is telling you not to, to continue moving forward. I have the Six of Pentacles. This has to do with giving, a give and take, an equal give and take, charity, uh, helping someone, providing a service. Seven of Wands. This is a long-term investment. This is doing the work and then reaping the rewards. This is also patience. <gasps> I just saw the lovers. Oh my gosh. Okay. Wow, all these cards. Okay, I'm done. So before I saw the lovers though, I saw the Knight of Wands. This could be somebody coming in full of passion and charming. Maybe a fire sign, but this could this could be somebody that that kind of acts reckless too. However, I have the lovers. I think this is just telling you to be cautious, but I have the lovers. That this a love connection that that could be on its way to you. Maybe this love connection is coming fast, or maybe somebody comes in. And the energy they have is like a really big free spirit, but it still has a love connection here. This is a, a person that brings you balance, a person that makes you feel safe, a person you can call home. It's like the person you can't wait to go home to is kind of like how I feel when I'm doing this reading. I have the Empress and I have Temperance. The Empress is marriage material. The Empress is, the Empress is beautiful. This is an attractive person or there's some, if it, if, I feel like when it comes to the Empress, it doesn't just have to be physical beauty. It's just something that's given off. It's like a beautiful type of energy. This is the ability to manifest. I feel like with the Empress energy, you may be somebody that people look to in regards to ideas of creativity. But this is healing. This could be a healing type of love, a love that brings balance. This has to do with balance as well, but this is healing and balance. So I feel like that it can bring a major sense of balance, maybe balance you haven't had before. We have the six 
of cups, this person could possibly feel very familiar. Maybe this is a soulmate, somebody from a past life. It's another healing card. It's like this is going to be very healing and be very balancing for you. And then I have the Eight of Wands. This is some sort of rapid change. So let's see. This may like come out of nowhere. So let's see what we have in the Oracle cards. I have the Moon. Pay attention to your intuition at this time and move ahead confidently. Dragonfly, have confidence during this time of great joy, renewal, and connect to spirit. Oh, and connection to spirit, my bad. Oh my gosh, stop. Look. Love, love surrounds all your connections. Move forward positively in all areas of your life. I swear I just had this in my Capricorn reading. And then proposal, a romance or uh, excuse me, a romantic or business opportunity is indicated. And let me pull one more card. I'm going to pull it from the bottom. Like I did this one. Plain. A journey is indicated, either physically or metaf metaphorically. Your life will become more full. I'm going to leave you with that, Pisces. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, I love you guys. Bye.